I, I, don't, I don't know what that was. But. So, um, today I'm gonna be filming a haul, like a collective haul. I've been meaning, I meant to like film this like weeks ago, but like that's okay because I just like got more stuff that I can add to it. And yeah, first off, I'm gonna address the obvious. I'm wearing red lipstick, which I normally don't, but it's Canada Day today. So, figured I might as well be festive. And I have festive nails too, but yeah, I have a lot of stuff in the haul so i'm just gonna like jump like right into it i think i'll start with a store called the ultimate fan so it's this store that's just like in my town like in my mall and it has like a bunch of like sports stuff i don't know why that took me so long to remember that but i've gone there like a couple times over the past like she like last time that i did a haul so yeah i'm just gonna show you the stuff that i got from there the first time i went there i got lanyards because like I actually need them and I spent like $37 on lanyards because like two of them were $10 and then one was 15 so you know but yeah I just got three of them so I got one for work which is this Oilers one right here as you can see yeah there you go so I just got this Oilers one yeah, I'm gonna use this for like my name tag at work, but like I hope it works because of like the class But if not, then I'll just like use another one of them If this one won't work for work, but I originally like got it for it And then the next one I got was for my keys And it's just this Dallas Stars one And Yeah, it's just What it looks like It has like this kind of class so maybe I'll use that one for work I don't know because that's like the one that I already have or use this one for work if the Oilers one doesn't fit but yeah and then the other one I got just because it was a Marcus Stroman one and he's my favorite picture I think I mentioned it in one of my videos but maybe I didn't but if I didn't now you know so yeah I just got this this is the one that was 15 because it's a player one and it has the same stuff in like white too so and then the next time i went to the ultimate fan i wanted to get like a pittsburgh penguins hat and so i just got this one it just looks like that it's just a baseball hat just has like this logo on the side and yeah it says penguins on the back here and when i went in there like the guy that like owns the store he said that if you spend like $50 or more like in the entire mall then you could like go to customer service and like give them this gift card or no not give them this gift card get this coupon and then you could get a free Jay's travel mug and like I was going to get a Golden State Warriors hat too and they didn't have one at that store but they have one at Lids I actually ended up getting two of them which I will show you in the haul but later on but yeah so I did that because like why would I pass up a free Jay's travel mug and I was going to spend that much money anyways. This is just what it looks like. Just says Blue Jay's, has their logo, has the maple leaf on the back. The guy also told me that if the Penguins and the Warriors won the cup because I was, or one, Penguins won the cup, the Warriors won the NBA, that they would be getting in like their championship like merch and stuff because I was wearing like a Warriors shirt when I went in there and then wearing a penguins or buying the penguins hat and so like obviously he knew I was like a fan of both of the teams and well obviously they both ended up winning and the Warriors stuff actually like hasn't like come in yet like I've went in a couple times and yeah like I guess like Adidas takes like really long for like their shipments to come in and but like once I get that I'm just gonna like add that into the haul. I did go in after the penguins won the cup and I got two shirts one i got one penguins one and then a leaf shirt I'll show you the penguins one that i got it just looks like that i don't know how well you can see it this t-shirt is so soft like i can't wait to wear it and i was hoping they would have like i got the one when they won last year and i was hoping that they would have something that like mentioned them being like back-to-back -back champions but they didn't but i mean it's still fine
And then I got a Lee shirt because they had like player shirts and Mitch Marner is one of like my favorite hockey players just like in general and I do like the Leafs like, now like I used to like make fun of my dad for liking them and but like I never actually hated them I just made fun of my dad because they sucked but like they don't suck now and you can call me a bandwagon fan or whatever but like I really like a lot of their players now so it just has their new logo and yeah it just looks like that and then on the back it just says Marner and has his number because he's probably my favorite Leafs player well, probably like him and Nylander, but they did have a Nylander shirt too, but I just got the one for now because it's like, I ain't about to spend like a hundred dollars in here. So now I'm going to show you the stuff that I got from Liz. And again with Liz, I went there a couple times and got like different things. So the first time I went, I just got this LA Kings baseball hat. I was just looking for like a nice like cheap baseball hat. This one was like $12 or something because it was on their $12 rack. And I like the Kings too. Like I said, I like a lot of, blah, I like a lot of hockey teams and I like LA and I like the Kings. So I got this hat. Like I said, I also went to get Warriors hats from there. Oh, and also that Kings hat I've worn in a haul before. Or not a haul, a vlog. I think I I wore it to Chance, which like you haven't seen that vlog yet, but you probably will by the time this video is up. And I also wore it to the weekend. But yeah, like I said, I got two Warriors hats too when I went to Lids. So I could like spend over $50 and get that gift card. So I got this one. It's just black and white. Or no, it's black and like silver. It says Golden State Warriors and I've worn it obviously because there's like cat hair on it. I've worn like all of these hats. And then I just got this one too that just has their logo and it's blue and black. Obviously as you can tell like I really like don't know what to say in haul. It's like you can like see what the stuff looks like but I feel like I have to be saying something. Also when I went into Lids that day like it was a very productive shopping day because when I went into Lids the guy was like oh like you've like spent like so much that you can like sign up for like our card for free for the first year and with the card you get like 25% um, off like every purchase that you make like online or like in the store which you know like 25% like that's a better discount than I get at Walmart but so obviously I wasn't gonna say no to that especially if it's free for the first year and then I think it was like three dollars or something I don't know after that but it's not very expensive but yeah so I wanted to get a Steph Curry jersey and like they didn't have any in my mall but I knew that like Lids sells jerseys like on their website and so I went on their website. They had a Steph Curry jersey on like clearance for like $96, which is crazy. And because of like, and then I got like the 25% discount off. So it took away like more than like tax and like the shipping. Or no, I think shipping was free, but it took away like tax. So what the jersey looks like, it's so nice. Like literally not like a string is coming off of it at all. And yeah, I what size did I get? I got a medium, and because I wanted it to be like a little big, but yeah, it just looks like that, obviously. Now I'm gonna show you like merch that I got at the concerts I went to, so the weekend and chance so i'm going to show you the weekend merch first just because i went to him first i wanted to like get a hoodie and a t-shirt but then i ended up like not liking the hoodies that much like there wasn't like anything on the front of them except for it just being just like plain black so i just got two t-shirts instead which was a lot cheaper the first t-shirt that i got just looks like this it's just like a silhouette it looks white here but i swear it's not oh wait you can kind of see and it's actually like colored it's like orange and teal but with the lighting it looks white and then just says legend of the fall in the back yeah, and 
so then I got the tour t-shirt that like everyone has that I'm sure you've seen like I know like Nathan Zed has it and like a bunch of like other people but yeah this is what it looks like it's so cool like I love the like picture on it or the design of it so just a Starboy Legend of the Fall tour it just has a logo on the back Okay, so then I'm gonna show you the stuff that I got from Chance. First off, I got this poster and it got wet because it rained and like I have like a whole like story time about like the rain and stuff that I'll probably like film with my friend Sophie because like she was with me and like we got like separated at one point like after and it was just, it was crazy but yeah. So I'm gonna like try and show it. Yeah, I'm just gonna try and like roll it out. It's just like the, uh, the, the coloring book album art as you can see and i'll show you the clothes that i got from there i just got a t-shirt and a hoodie so so this is a t-shirt it just says chance the rapper be encouraged to wear it's like navy it looks kind of black on here but it's navy blue and white and red and then it just has like all the dates on the back show you the hoodie that I got. This has like a three and then it just like has hands like holding a circle around it. And then this is just what the back looks like. Again it just like has all the tour dates and this is like so warm and soft. Like I had to wear it because my other hoodie that I took to the concert got soaked because like so do we so I so I put it on like as soon as I bought it because it like stopped raining then. And this one ended up getting soaked too. Now, I guess I'm gonna show you some stuff that I got from Walmart, the dollar store, and like the superstore, but they're all just like in this bag here. So first off, from the superstore, I got one of like the cover girl, uh, cover girl melting pelt. I literally thought it was pot, but no, it's melting pelt, which like I think melting pot's a cooler name. But yeah, obviously it's like a ripoff or of the Too Faced ones, like the melted like liquid lipsticks or whatever they're called, but yeah, those are like really expensive. These are like half the price, and like hopefully they're like a good dupe for them or whatever. Like I don't actually have the Too Faced ones, so I can't compare it to them, but I do know that I like swatched it on my hand and it like stayed on there for like days through me like washing my hands, so like hopefully that means it'll stain pretty well, but the color that I got is in 150 raspberry jelly i'm probably gonna get more of them if i end up liking them but this is just the color i liked the most and it's not like any color that i have so because i tend to like get just like a lot of like nude shades it's like really pigmented it's like this berry color and yeah i was like wanting a color like this for a while so hopefully this is a good formula walmart non-makeup thing that i got from there or just some NHL stickers so they have like all the teams except for Vegas and it is like some of like their older logos because like you can see Florida's the older one and so it was like the Dallas Stars one which is like oh my god okay this is so not showing up well on the back here but yeah it has just like regular stickers and then there's like these shimmery ones I'm trying to get it to like stay focused but yeah, I just got them to like decorate my laptop with for the makeup related stuff at Walmart So I needed a new primer, so I got a new one uh, And this is the hard candy sheer envy color correcting primer um, I like use this like regularly just because it's cheap I'm not sure how like good of like a primer it is and it does feel a little thick But I feel like I don't know primer something you like have to use right? Cause it's like good for like your skin and shit. Yeah, I don't know if it really like makes my makeup last long, but I have a setting spray that makes it last really long. It's like the L'Oreal Infallible one. And then I got the Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream. Like I'm wearing it right now. Like it's like okay coverage, like BB cream is. I just got it for the summer because sometimes I like wearing like less makeup or you can just like throw it on. 
if I'm like in a rush, so yeah, and it has SPF in it, doesn't it? That's one of the main reasons that I got it, and that doesn't even have it in it. Wow, okay, I know some BB creams have SPF, but this one doesn't apparently, but okay. Well, I feel betrayed. The next thing I got is this face mask that I want to try out. It's the brand Freeman. So it's face mask expert since 1976. So yeah, I don't, I've like never really heard this brand reviewed. So I don't know how good they are, but my friend Kaylee got one of them. She like came through my toe and got one. And then I was like, oh, like that's actually a pretty good, like I don't remember how much it was, but it's like, oh, that's good for like a face mask, like a good, price for one and it looks like there's a lot in there so I might as well try one out and so I got this one it's a polishing charcoal and black sugar gel mask slash scrub it's supposed to detoxify pores and exfoliate exfoliate for, exfoliate for smooth skin wow why can't I speak but yeah I know that charcoal is supposed to be like really good for your skin so that's why I got the charcoal one and I haven't tested it out yet, but maybe I'll do like a first impressions or something. It looks like, like on the skin. And like obviously you're supposed to like spread it out to make it look like a mask. And then you like rub it in. Last thing that I got is this L'Oreal, or no, it's not L'Oreal. This is a Rimmel Magnify Eyes eyeshadow palette. I'm just gonna swatch them all and then show them to you. Shit, I thought I was track of the colors I was doing. These are actually amazing. Holy shit. This pigmentation, you guys. Yeah, you can see the colors from like lightest to darkest. They're actually like really pigmented. They look like so good swatch, like in real life. Like they don't look that good on camera, but like trust me. I went to the dollar store with my mom the other day. As we were like leaving, I noticed like nail polish and it was like Sally Hansen. And I was like, okay, Sally Hansen's a good brand. Like they can't be bad for dollar store uh, nail polish if it's Sally Hansen. So I just got two colors. They're both kind of like neutral colors. The first one is called Bad to the Bone. And it's just this like creamy or I guess like bone <laughs> color. And then the next one that I got is called Hardcore Party and it's just this like pinky color and my lighting is so bad but winners. So I got two things. The first thing I thought the first thing I got is just this jo Josh Donaldson t-shirt. You can see because he has like his like silhouette. The next thing I got is basically like Nike's version of Superstar. So they're like tennis shoes, like that. I just got the white ones, and I want to get some of like that spray, and I want to like put it on my Superstars too. That. You know the dirt and like everything slides off of them but yeah so they look like that they just have like the nike on the heel and you can see they have like the swoosh but it's in like white so it's kind of hard to see this is what the laces look like and like the flaps of them and yeah these are really nice and i can like wear them to work and stuff Toby's finally done in the bathroom. I think she had explosive diarrhea. I did not!